guys, it is me, Life Simmer, and welcome back to The Sims 3 Seasons LP Part 3. Let's retry that. Hey guys, it is me, Life Simmer, and welcome back to The Sims 3 Showtime LP Part 3. This is definitely not Seasons. Um, <laughs> don't know where I got that one from, but yeah, that just happened. Um, but yeah, welcome back. You guys are probably looking at the screen like, what is going on? Why is Naomi and Trey fighting? I don't know. I did not cause this. They did this by themselves. I just was like, all right, I guess I'll I'll start filming while this is happening. Started off on a, a feisty note. So uh, let's see who wins. <laughs> Mariah's like, I'm out of here. Oh, and Trey lost. Yeah, he lost. All right. And um, actually, Naomi's in her new uh, outfit. Level two. Acrobat. Looking pretty cute, huh? But yeah, they really hate each other. I do not know. Like, okay, I kind of know why. Kind of, kind of, in a way, caused it. I uh, kind of made them yell at each other a bit. But not to the point where I thought they were going to fight. Jesus. I mean, they really hate each other. But whatever. All the hatred will definitely help. Because Trey now gets all this attention. And he's a social butterfly. So whether it's negative or positive, he's getting some uh, attention. So whatever awesome mariah just did a singogram right here actually um and how close is she to leveling up oh she's really close actually why don't you go ahead and is there another guy here no i don't know where that noise is coming from but we are going to head to head right over here there is a sim fest actually going on um let me tell you guys a little bit about um sim fest pretty much sims will come here and it's like a talent show and you come here and you watch sims perform and before you know it you're on that stage performing yourself and people will either be throwing you know flowers at you <laughs> like thank you thank you thank you so much oh yes as kevin hart would say yes <laughs> i love kevin hart or they're going to be throwing tomatoes at you, nasty stuff, negative comments, all that gross stuff. Um, so we're actually, Mariah's right around the corner. Let's come watch. And there is actually quite a crowd. There's a lot of people here. So, uh, yeah, let's see if we can get a show. Uh, we can watch one. It's really neat. Like, the guy even comes up, well, the proprietor comes up and... And it's like, up next is so-and-so. It's really neat. <laughs> oh, we have to go perform a singogram. We will. After, after we do this. Alrighty, and here is a chick coming on up. Oh, she's doing a magic show. Let's watch this. She looks like Mariah. Let me just pat my head a little bit more. Ooh! Dedrick will be better than this broad. She has nothing on us. Just keeps pulling her wand out. <laughs> Ooh, the music! Damn, get it! Oh, I love the music. Oh, I'm so excited for Dedrick to do this! Oh! This is exciting. Oh, here comes her little, her little helper. <laughs> uh oh. Ooh. She can't get the last one in. <laughs> oh no, there it goes. Oh, that is so cool. Oh. 
I'm gonna laugh if the girl's like dead. Oh, there she is! So freaking neat! I liked it! I did! See, now here are your options. You know, you can heckle the performer, make a request, throw stuff at the stage. You have flowers. Um, you can even go up to cow plants, which are very expensive. Uh, food, you know, all that stuff. You can throw an effing juice box, okay? Suck on that. Um, ingredients, you know, all that. Fruits, tomatoes, hello. Um, vegetables, and there's just so much. Uh, there's one more performer. What is this? Our next contestant, Allison Over Easy. Good luck. If she's a singer, oh, she's an acrobat. All right, so yeah, let's go ahead and watch her too. Oops, don't want to quit. Her stage props aren't as cool. But look at her. Do something exciting. Come on now. Oh, there we go. She listened to me. She did a backflip. Love it. <laughs> she sneezed. She's a lot better than Naomi, I will say that much. <laughs> Naomi has some work to do. The struggle. Seriously. Um, you know what? I I feel bad. Naomi's probably at home crying right now because this chick is doing better than her. And I even said it. So, we're going to throw some stuff at the stage. We're going to throw some tomatoes and scream. It was horrifying. Where are we? Where are we? <laughs> Let's see if Mariah will actually throw it. Oh, Mariah. Let's, let's, uh... Her. Right? <laughs> I feel like she's like being super evil right now. <laughs> I love Mariah. Alright, alright. Enough Simfest. You actually have to go do your job. Everybody else is loving it. Everybody else is loving it. So, we're gonna leave. This, would, this girl would be kind of cute for uh, Dead Drake, wouldn't she? Magicians together forever. Oh my goodness, would these two stop? You two have stuff to do. Naomi, knock it off, seriously. Um, we need to go find her, actually, a gig. We are going to head to the coffee house for the very first time. And hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, we can actually get a gig there that'd be really awesome i just have to figure out where it is i totally forget um coffee house coffee house where is it oh i'm so lost um what is this the tot spot playground oh i love when they do little stuff like this you know it's just a playground for toddlers and children it's so cute and children's that made so much uh sense um, children's, hmm. Anyways, um, where the hell is it? Is this it? This is the coffee house right here. Yeah. Yeah. And here's the proprietor. I'm, I'm almost positive I'm saying that wrong. Um, we're gonna come here and audition for an acrobat gig. And Dedrick, not Dedrick, <laughs> I mean Trey, um, he is going to... He's, instead of talking to himself, he's going to head to the Summer Festival grounds and go, um, perform for tips. So it's a go audition for our first gig. Super exciting. I like your little outfit, too. It's pretty cute. There's a sim fest going on right there. <laughs> so awkward for her. 
Aw, I think he likes it. I don't think you're quite ready to perform here. Are you effing kidding me, dude? Where am I supposed to perform? Freaking the SimFest won't take me. Like, nowhere will actually take us. Let's see if we can maybe, possibly, probably not come here. Now we can't. Damn. What the heck? <laughs> Look at these Sims. They are really getting into it. They're like, hey. And he's like, how? Oh, hey. She's a how. Oh, hey. <laughs> I'm so hyper today. Oh, here's. Come on. I really feel like I'm watching Twilight right now. Is that weird to say? Is that kind of geeky to say? Probably. But you know, like Jacob walking in with his shirt off with like his whole crew. I don't know. There's Trey. Um, so he is going to instant cards and then instant wand into flowers. I don't know. And then he's also going to perform for tips. Oh, he did a good job with that one. No. Don't perform for tips over here, though. Go interrupt the show. And, like, run in there, too, because you're insane. That's it for today. SimFest is over, and he's over here like, No, it is not. I have a show for all of you. They really loved it. Oh, look at his little outfit. Oh, it's so cute. Look, he has a crowd. He has a really big crowd. Oh, this is Dedrick's. Do I keep saying Dedrick? Yes, I do. This is Trey's way of coming big. Oh, <gasps> jerks. Oh, I liked you. I thought you'd be super cute with him. And you have nothing nice to say. And then here's this old guy just watching. Oh my gosh. He reminds me of somebody. Charlie Ray Buckshot. Buckshot. Billy Ray Cyrus, possibly? I don't know. Come on, give him a good show, boy. This is your chance. Really quickly, I'm going to search up. You know what? They made these for a reason. Where are they? Da, 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 lessons. Um, let's go ahead and check this out. Yep. Yep. Up and coming acrobats will be able to join SimFest in auditions for gigs. Uh, well, apparently we're just not good enough. Um... What is this? Acrobats at the peak of their career will have the opportunity to perform at arena sized venues. Cannot wait till we do that. But I I guess we need to work on it a little bit more because I really think our first gig is definitely going to be SimFest. Um, so we're going to come here and work out more and Trey's over here, hopefully making some great tips. Because I mean, there are people watching him. Uh, Mariah doesn't have a job to do right now, but she is so close to actually leveling up that we might as well get out of this person's house and actually do something. We're going to do a little bit of competition with Trey. We're going to head here and uh, sing a little bit. People are beginning to like him. That's good. But yeah, we're going to come here and give him a little bit of a competition and, and see who, who does it better. We are going to perform for tips. And the competition begins. So far, Trey has them all. Wrong part. Okay, I need to stop is what I need to do. All right, Trey, you're done. Obviously, you won this one. Let her have her moment. <laughs> Guys, just having a good uh, hot dog. Oh, he's kind of cute. He has like a very mature sexiness. Javard Mir. 
not even singing anymore, just staring straight into these people's souls. Wow. Oh, Bryce, he's handsome too. Very handsome Sims here in Starlight Shores. Yes! Congratulations, Mariah has been conferred the new title of a Singagram Pro by the Starlight Shores Town Council in recognition of her valuable contributions to the workforce. Yay! You're getting bigger with every Singagram perform, and now you have a new romantic Singagram to add to your repertory. Mariah now makes 340 simoleons per week, which now that means we actually have new songs, I'm pretty sure, which one of the songs that we actually get, okay, her face just moved, but one of the songs that we get, oh, I love it, oh, yes, it's Oogie Fever, oh, girl, stop singing that, do Oogie Fever, Oogie Fever right now. Do it. This is one of my all-time favorites. Oogie Fever. It's from The Sims 1. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm a fan. Oh, he gave us tips. Awesome. A $24 tip. Thank you. He's like, yeah, maybe she'll want to woohoo with me. Sims 1 Classic. She has a very soulful voice right now. <laughs> Doesn't really look like she's singing it. She's really getting into it though. I just love this song. Oh! Oh! Did you guys see that? Oh! She just did the. What's it called? Damn, I forget. The moonwalk. Oh my goodness. I love it. Oh, I'm loving it so much. I love the moonwalk in this. Oogie fever. Love it. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Oh, here comes the chorus. Um, by the way, when you usually sing, you have options to like sing the chorus over and over again when you're performing and all that good stuff. But let's go ahead and um see if we can actually get a gig here. Oh, and we have a singagram to perform. Um, Trey, why don't you go ahead and head home? He's already on his way home. I always need to work on getting him up. And, yeah. Let's, uh, go see if we can get a gig here. They're probably gonna say, like, sweetie, <laughs> please, in your dreams. But you never know. Maybe we have the eye of the tiger and they just, just want us so badly. She's going to woo her. Oh my gosh. We got our... Ah! Awesome. So, uh... This is great. We actually have a gig. Our first ever gig. Your audition was great, Mariah. We'd love to... Here, let me do this voice. Your audition was great, Mariah. We'd love to have you perform at Verne Park Summer Festival Grounds at 27 Park... Palm Park Avenue at Wednesday. On Wednesday at 7.30 p.m. Be there sharp. Okay, so yeah, we have our first gig. And now we actually have right here a gig schedule. Um, yeah, so this is awesome. It's our first gig. It's uh, three hours long. Oh, this is so exciting. We need to get some money really badly. We need to go get some money um, to actually, you know, have money for some props. Um, this is really exciting. 
Trey, are you effing kidding me? He's giving himself a sponge bath <laughs> while Naomi's being a diva and taking a nice bath. Um, she's actually halfway to leveling up to an acrobat level three, which is exciting. And Trey's slowly working his way up. He wants to talk to Bryce and to Yolanda and to Priscilla. They all seem like pretty decent people. He does need Tino. Meet some people. So actually tomorrow, Trey, you'll go ahead and give them all a call. Do you see Naomi just put her head under? <laughs> She's so funny. Um, but yeah, they're all really tired. They have big days ahead of them. So she's just going to go have a little snack and go to sleep. Um, but she's over here. All right. You can head home now, Mariah. I probably won't have enough money to buy much props. Um, but we'll try our best. You know, it's our first gig. We don't need anything too crazy. But I do want something a little fun. There's actually a raccoon outside. Raccoon. She's going to go to sleep. And we are going to start tomorrow off with a fresh new look at the day. Alrighty? I will see you guys okay, in the Okay, guys. So it is now morning time. And Trey's going a little crazy. Also, sorry if I've been like, I don't know, possibly eating your eardrums away. I just realized how li loud my microphone was. And then the next part will be fixed. I'm just a loud ass bitch. Oh, I'm sorry. I've been trying not to cuss. I really have been. I am just a loud booty wench is that better um i'm sorry it's just a habit it really is it's hard not to cuss but i'm trying for you guys i've definitely been cutting down except in my walking dead lps i'm sorry i just cannot then especially when bad stuff happens it just comes out so yeah <laughs> but anyways trey's deciding to get super juiced before he starts his day off this is his uh breakfast everyone um he's going to get a little juiced and then call his friends up or talk to himself. He's going to call this chick right here, Priscilla, and see who she's all about. Maybe Trey will make some good friends. He's a social butterfly. Oh, try calling back in about 17 hours. Um, okay. Let's go ahead and chat with this girl. Sorry. Try calling back in about 17 hours. What are you guys doing for 17 hours? So, oh my gosh okay um forget it we'll try another time sorry for trying to be social really so sorry oh come on as soon as she wakes up he does <laughs> they really do not like each other he literally was he just pointed his finger and said shut up <laughs> i love it i love the the drama between these two she's like calm down calm down I love it. Mariah's just like, just gonna eat some waffles and clean up the house a little bit while you two's fight like this. Um, yeah, they really hate each other, but they're roommates and they do not have like any simoleons, so they're gonna have to get over it. Um, we're gonna go use the toilet and we actually need to set up an outfit for Mariah. Um, because I do not want her to wear something gross. Uh, to her first gig it has to be super freaking cute and I think the perfect outfits that you know would just work amazingly for any gigs that you do I don't care if you're a magician an acrobat or a singer or possibly even a DJ you absolutely have to get the singing stars collection it is it's from the sims 3 store of course hello but um it came out right after uh, Showtime came out, and I, for the longest time, could not have it because I was broke. I mean, I did not have any money. It was rough, but, you know, I I finally got it, and let me tell you guys, it's amazing, all right? It's, um, it's definitely star-quality clothing. See, it's right here. Definitely star-quality clothing, um, and it's just, it's perfect, absolutely perfect for exactly what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be for your show. Alrighty, so this outfit is super freaking cute. It is from Seeing Stars, well, the outfit is, and I kind of edged it up a little bit. 
Um, I think it is so cute. Mariah, to me, kind of just gives off this illusion where she's very edgy and super adorable. But anyways, yeah, this is from the Seeing Stars collection and her shoes are custom content. But uh, I thought it was really neat. You know, when you perform on stage, you want to look a little different. So uh, I really do love this outfit on her. Um, very edgy. So singing Oogie Fever in this might not be the best idea, but you know, it's cute. So I like it. Um, when is her gig actually? At 7.30. So we will probably end this part soon and in the next part have our gig actually. But Naomi is going to do some chin-ups, work out a bit this morning, like usual. All right. Oh, I, she's just in a horrible mood. Um, let's see. What does she need? She's very sore. She's offended and humiliated. All because of somebody. Trey, all right, enough is enough, buddy. Uh, Trey's going to come eat some waffles. And Naomi, I just, it's <sighs> just not a good mood, like, whatsoever. She's going to come pick up the trash can because the raccoon knocked it over and clean up a little bit. Um, we could go try to audition for an acrobat gig. I don't know if we would get in, but we're going to try. Maybe we'll perform again. Well, not again, but maybe we'll perform um, with Mariah. If there's like a sim fest or something going on. So let's see. And Trey. Trey, how about you stop drinking up and you head to the summer festival. Pretty sure she's going to reject us like usual. Don't forget, Mariah has a gig at Verde Park Summer Festival Grounds at 7.30 p.m. today. How could I forget? It's our first gig. Come on, let us in. Aw, oh, she says, I don't think you're quite ready. Whatever. We're going to come play some golf. Uh, this golf right here, this like little golf set. I forget what it's called. Miniature golf. Um, it came with Showtime. We had it in The Sims 2. If you unlocked it with your career, you got it. So, you know, seeing this come back was pretty cool. But, yeah. This is it. Miniature golf. Or putt-putt, whatever it's called. I know there's like some special name for it being like that. Go on. <laughs> and I'm um, actually, yeah, brings up her athletic skill, which is pretty cool too. You know, she can engage on a fun activity while bringing up her athletic skill. Probably not as fast as if maybe she was actually working out, but still. Um, Trey's here now. He's going to come over here and perform uh, for some tips. Let's let him kind of do his thing over here. And um, let's see. Current job. Performance starts at 7.30 p.m. But we don't need to head there for quite a bit of time. So. <laughs> so what we will actually do is go perform this. Uh, what is this? Yeah, well, it's not time for a gig quite yet. Um. We can enthuse about our upcoming show. I guess we will actually know. Yeah, we'll go enthuse about our upcoming show. I was going to say, let's go do karaoke, but I'd rather wait for like the whole group to go out and do kind of a karaoke night. I think that'd be kind of fun. Um, Trey, are you making money out there, buddy? He's working on it. <laughs> I feel like the magician's a little bit harder. I feel like the easiest one to level up on is definitely the acrobat. It just comes so easy with the athletic skill. Um... I think the magician's probably the hardest one because, you know, you don't have, like, the singograms or the athletic skill. It's all based on pure, like, illusions and tips. So, yeah. Um, sorry. I have to wash my hair. I need to clean my toothbrush. My schedule's pretty booked. Oh, what a jerk. You're going to be here anyways. So why put us down about it? Whatever. Let's um, really quickly actually look. I'll show you guys some of the props uh, that come with Showtime. 
Um, obviously, you're going to have some props. I mean, hello. Um, they're not too expensive. They're pretty cheap. But if you really want to go all out and, you know, get like lights and stuff, that definitely adds up. But if you're like me and, you know, we're going to kind of cheap out on our first one because we don't have any money, you just have stuff like, you know, I won't show them all to you right now, but eventually we'll get through them all. Um, you know, some skyscrapers, you have like lamps, magician stuff, the giant hat, you know, stuff like this, random stuff, props. Um, a lot of stuff for Dudrick. I could place this one down. You guys pretty much get the gist of what this is, right? It's just a big tent. Um, ice cream cones, which we'll probably end up doing for Mariah as her first one. Kind of like a Katy Perry sweet treats in a way. Um, <laughs> just kind of throw this stuff up there. And we have chess pieces and parks. And what is that? Oh, it's a, oh, it's a creepy doll. Oh, I do not like that one. But I'll probably end up using it too. Um, and we have like a scary backdrop, which actually, no, this would be perfect, absolutely perfect for her first gig. This and the creepy doll because of her outfit. That's definitely what we need to do for her first gig. It'd be, it'd be cute. Not, not necessarily cute, but a little creepy, but it would work. We have cauldrons and, oh, not a cauldron, a Kinder Libra, somewhere, whatever it's called. Oh, this one's kind of neat. A crystal ball, ooh. And some, you know, the basics. Statue of Liberty singer. That way, this way, whatever. And this is actually a custom, not a custom content, but a store premium content item. It is the hypnotizer. You can hypnotize Sims with this and uh, we'll be perfect for Dedrick. Not Dedrick, oh, I keep calling him Dedrick. Perfect for Trey. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, but what we're going to go ahead and do, guys, is end this part here. Um, in the next part, we are going to have our first gig, which is super exciting. And I do want um, Dedrick to level up. He should level up in the next part, I think. I think him and Naomi should level up by the next part. Um, so, with that being said... I will see you guys in the next part. I hope you guys enjoyed this part. The next part will probably come tomorrow since it's uh, Saturday. And I'm going to try to upload a lot of videos on Saturday. Um, let me just really quickly, like a really, really quick update. I, for one, I have actually, I need to make a whole update video because there's a lot I got to tell you guys. All good stuff, of course. But um, let me just tell you that I just... I plan on spamming you guys on Saturdays. Um, probably Spam Saturday. Remember Spam Saturday? Yes, you do. Um, I just feel like Saturdays are really good, good days for me to film. Um, usually Saturdays, I'm not busy. Come Saturday night, Sunday, I'm always busy. So Spam Saturday will most likely be a thing again. And uh, get your tater tots and your ketchup and your drinks and your laptop or computer or whatever you watch me on. Get that ready because I'm excited. Woo! Summer's coming. I'm just, I don't know. I'm in a really good mood. So I'm probably going to film another part. But I hope you guys enjoyed this part. I love you all so much. And I will see you guys next time. Alrighty? I love you guys so much. Bye, guys.